Welcome back to another episode of Hard and Uncut. You find me just looking at these two missions. We're going to get going really quickly today. Um, we're going to set off to Minmus, but first I have uh, two missions that I need to complete. We need to actually do this. So let's take a, a probe core, do that. Um, and I want, oh, what is it? It is should be a rover part around here somewhere. Rover mate, rover. Is that the one? Is that, what's the mission for? A Rover Max Model 2S. That's that one there. Okay, so that is we've got to be at the launch site. We've got to do that, and then I need an engine as well. So we need a poodle. Put that on there. You may be asking yourself, Sea Monsters, why why are you doing this? Why is this occurring here? Well, quite simply, we're just going to launch this. Um, I need a little bit of extra money for us to actually launch our uh, our Minmus mission and to be able to do EVAs. So that's why we're doing this. Right, thank you for all the comments so far. We'll just uh, start this off. That's one mission done. Um, let's do this, uh, run test, all done. I think so, wonderful, recover that. Yeah, thank you for all your comments. Uh, thank you for um, suggestions about other series. Uh, I put a poll up on uh, on the channel and we got some really interesting feedback, some good comments, things like that. That has not given me enough, I don't believe, unless there's anything else. Flight, flight, uh, terrier at the launch site it's going to give me like three thousand it's still not going to be enough uh, we'll take it anyway because it's always nice to have and these things right we're going to do this without uh, eva which is annoying i was hoping we could do it with some eva um so yeah thank you for all of those um yeah love some of the stuff on the discord with uh with the ideas and things like that and some of the um suggestions for um just generally oh we're gonna put the pilot in there um just generally ideas for craft ideas for mods to put in a modded series things like that is really good it's actually started a little bit of a debate about what's compatible with what um i'll talk to you about that once we launch this thing though so let's just save that let's uh i think that's going to be okay we're going to launch that right so aim for this one is we're going to go to minmus uh, we have maneuver nodes so i can do it sort of easier more more easier easier that's not a phrase more easily uh, but i want to get into orbit as quickly as possible you see i'm actually moving around a lot of speed there just get this going um up we go wonderful perfect get a bit of a timey-wimey warp on and start heading over just a smidge and there we go that's good like get that over there uh, yeah, so yeah, the feedback to the series has been really good. I really enjoy seeing all of your feedback. We'll put it on Prograde, actually, just do that. Um, it's been really good to, to be able to see the feedback that you, you're given and things like that. Oh, we're not, we don't have solids. I just remembered that. So we might as well ramp this up to maximum and then stick that like that. All right, so it's been really good to actually see your feedback and things like that. Uh, the only reason you wouldn't want to do that is if you were doing this. So let's just do that, get up until we're up a bit thicker and then we'll do that. Um, yeah, so please continue to like and subscribe the channel and, and comment down below. It really helps the uh, the algorithm cracking and things like that. Um, comments and suggestions, always welcome. I'll get rid of those. Thank you. Um, and then we're basically going to put our nose down a little bit. There we go. Thank you. Got to pop it like that. I want to actually be uh, equatorial, so that's why I'm just going below. I want on surface. I want to be on equatorial orbital. Right. We're just going to let this burn. Um, actually, we can ramp it up a little bit want to get into orbit first of all we don't want to just hang around this altitude um, and then we're going to do that there yeah let's do that and that put us actually put me onto the put me onto the prograde there we go and then lock it to there and then i'll just do that there we go uh, probably need a bit of altitude as well there we go perfect we're not really getting the speed to uh, to uh apple up said i would like the time to up up so i was like but it's fine it's fine we could hope should hopefully get up with this this stage and have a little bit of fuel left would be lovely but i'm not sure if we will there we go kill that now we can do something i haven't been able to do for so long we'll put a maneuver node in right um so yeah um feedback that we got people were interested we got a lot of votes for a uh, an rp1 style version one of these which i thought was quite interesting i have an idea for that it wouldn't be a full series it would go for a year i thought maybe a short series um and then we also had some ideas for modded ones as well which i am going to have a really good look at um, it is uh, a little bit of effort, a little bit of extra effort. It's a lot of extra effort putting another series on. I don't know if the channel could do two a day. I'm going to be honest. Um, so we will see. It depends how I feel because you know there is work and money and things like that. Uh, maybe I should start a Patreon. I think I actually have one, but anyway, I um, yeah, maybe I should say you know if I get X amount, I will do it. But I don't like doing things like that. I don't like asking for the monies. Um, so yeah, that's that's one thing. Um, what else? Um, yeah. 
comment and everything is just wonderful. It's really nice to have interaction. Um, if you are not already on the Discord, get on the Discord. I'd love that to be a bit more active. It does need, I think, a bit of a rearrangement, a bit of a reorganization. Um, we're actually able to go into time warp now. So we did that whole launch at two times speed. That's good. So it only took us like three minutes to get to orbit. Wonderful. Right, and then we're going to go for our, well, we're not in orbit yet, technically. We've got to do a little small, small problem of 200 meters per second burn, which actually to me suggests that we had a nice launch, but maybe, maybe it could have been better. I don't know. Put that to there, put that to there. There we go. And that's perfect. And then we're just going to wait until we get up into orbit. There we are. Perfect. Right, well, not perfect, but it's good enough. It's good enough for now. Right. Now what we're doing, we're going to go to Minmus. So the aim of this this thing today is to get to Minmus. Um, let us have a look. Oh, that's non-optimal. I'll be entirely honest with you. We're not optimal right now. Um, there is a few ways of doing this. There is a few cheeky ways. We could we could time warp if I was being really cheeky. I've maneuver. So what you can do is you can actually just do your your, your flyby of Minmus when it's at its uh, ascending descending node with Kerbin. That is one way of doing it. Um, and this is what I was potentially considering trying to do when we, we didn't have maneuver nodes, which was actually you can line up the Mun, Minmus and Kerbin. Um, and the idea is that you then, um, you hope, <laughs> you hope that, uh, and we could do this. Do, do, do. Oh, that's the moving, see I like that. That's quite a nice little, little sort of skill there, isn't it? Right, so do that, next one along. What are we getting? Are we getting any closer? Oh, got interceptions with everything. Right, we're not going to do that. Kill that. Kill that. Let's do it the uh, the old-fashioned way. We're just going to do a a burn to Minmus from right about here, about there would be fine. The desert above the. I don't want to do it at the desert airfield. The desert airfield, of course, the thing we found the other episode that I need to actually comment about. Yeah, I've I've never actually landed at or used the desert airfield. I do love the name desert airfield. Um, it would be nice to maybe visit it, but this series is a challenge because of the fact that, oh, are we gonna actually get any intercepts or anything? Possibly not. Um, it's a challenge because, ah, oh, there we are. That is an interesting one, I like that. What about if we go another way? I really want that to be on the apoapsis. So that's that, let's do a bit more. Nope, that's too much, do a bit of that. Too much. Um, I think that is going to do us okay, is it? Oh, what was that? That's a moon. Right, we need to be aware of that. Oh, actually, we do get a we get a we get a small interaction at flyby. Does it have a requirement for altitude? Because if it doesn't, it doesn't. So we could actually just pop in, pop back out there, and that would be perfect. Right. Let us uh, time warp, timey wimey to that. We could actually do this in a single dish. If I was really going for this, we've got seven, well, six and a half minutes left of this episode. Um, if I was really going for this, we would be looking at, can we, um, yeah, can we can we grab uh, so just a flyby like that if I was being a perfectionist, but uh, I am not a perfectionist, unfortunately. So we've got about, so this is what annoys me, turning around. So this is gonna take us about 30 seconds to turn this craft. And I started going the wrong way, so I, I now have to yeah, live with that. Um, what the, the big issue is these things these maneuvers now now these sort of standard maneuvers are eating into my time what i have noticed is we're now into week three week three well we finished week three we're actually entering the fourth week of the series i think is that right sermon yeah so we're actually this is like the first day of the of of the the fourth week and we've landed on the moon sort of we haven't been to minmus um, I need to get moving because, you know, it's not about tech limiting us right now. It's uh, it's time. Time is limiting us, right? Um, do I even... Yeah, we do. We have to do a little bit of time warp at every opportunity now, don't we? So we've got to do that. So we've got to fire that engine, right? Get going. Um, our pilot, interestingly, does not have enough to give us maneuver node locking. I, You know, we will get probe cores that will do that, and that will be lovely when we finally get those. Um, but at the moment, our pilot is limiting us a bit because we don't have the great cores and things like that. Oh, I need to stage that, and I haven't fixed the staging on that yet, so this does not do this. And I also have noticed my keyboard has, for some reason, got very noisy all of a sudden, which it didn't used to. Um, yes, so the aim here, hmm, I'm going to try. I was originally thinking we could land. 
um, but I'm actually thinking I want to save the landing primarily because I want a contract to come up for it um, instead of just jumping by. Now somebody could potentially help me in comments there. It used to be when Furble first brought in the contract system, you had to wait for the contracts to come up. Um, but I know the uh, the first, the world firsts, I think a lot of them are actually already sort of tempered so that they will actually auto set themselves if you complete them and so you don't miss out on that funding. Is that the case with all of them though? Because I would really love to know that. Right, we're going to, you know what I'm going to do? We're going to, I'm going to focus for you on Minmus. And we're going to, uh, we're not going to do that. We're going to do a bit of uh, controlled thrust, shall we say. It should actually be facing that way, but let's have a look. Um, are we anywhere near where we need to be? You know what? Let's actually go on the maneuver node. I'm actually being silly. We have a maneuver node that takes us there. Now this I don't think will now matter because we've got our timing out a little bit. So it'll be interesting to see what happens. Uh, sit it on the node, sit it on the node, control it, control it. How are we? Hmm. We're still we're still two meters per second out, which is interesting. I do not have an interaction, but that's okay. That's fine. Which way are we going? We're coming this way. Yeah. Right. So let's get rid of that. Right, and then we hit the at key, which will bring me back. So I'm coming along here. So I want to put a maneuver about here because I would really like to come in. Um, on the plane as it were and this is where this is where you end up using the extra delta v for for minimus type missions so first of all um let's have a look at this up uh i want to go down a bit oh, there we go um and then we're going to actually focus for you on minimus again and then we're going to come over here to our thingy doodle we're going to do this right and now i'm going to just play around with it a bit okay so we needed a bit more a bit more forward thinking and we need a bit more down down and down and down there's the plane of minimus so we want to go up a bit 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 i have two minutes now to get this done uh am i going to get this burn in two minutes is the question we can be a little cheaty on this one Let's give it a bit more push there we go i want to come in nice and close actually that is perfect that is also going to send me into a sort of high orbit of curbing but it's alright we can bring ourselves back down from that so there we go we're going to speed along there make sure we've got electric charge which we should have because we now have solar panels it's exciting solar panels and maneuver nodes we're like a proper space program right so this thing is much more much more sort of nimble we can actually just spin this thing around to wherever it needs to be and it will it will do it and and, and the best thing is it's actually gonna it's gonna charge up while it's doing it because the sun is there all saying that we're not actually aligned with the sun but uh any any electric at all if we had a pro core on this of course it would be using up some of that uh, some of that electricity just all the time so we would need to have these on but the interesting thing about capsules is of course they don't actually uh, seem to to use electric charge which i think is a bit weird personally but you yeah. know there we go um little tiny bit more now i'm not looking at the map on this one we're just going to see what happens there right that's zero so let's see what it has actually done for me oh that is that's an interesting one is that close enough um hmm. you know what we've got a minute so we're going to uh, we're going to speed through to about here uh warp to there that's five days three days really warp there jump back to our ship all right we got one minute are we going to get into the sphere of influence of minmus before that minute is up do we go into orbit because if i get the contract offer for orbit i think i'm tempted to go for it uh we're gonna we're gonna warp there uh you know what? i'm just gonna time it ah it's doing that again it does not want me to be able to control this with my keys which is it with my with my clicking somebody said about why do you always click up there but um yeah obviously now we have a problem whereby I have no choice. Oop. Go a bit faster. Come on. Getting in. Come on, come on, come on. I've got 27 seconds. I want to be in the sphere of influence of Minmus. Right. There we go. Come on. No. Go past. Thank you. Right. I've now done my flyby. Is that right? Right. So we've got the Poodle engine done. Good. That's done. We're exploring Minmus. Turn the speed down on that. Right. 
So we've got completed minimus, we get 40,000. Explore minimus, we've got 30,000, we've completed it. We have uh, da, 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 first flyby minimus, we get an extra 17. So that's with the world first. And that's it. So from me, until next time, have a great one.